Repair Clinic encourages you to perform this procedure safely. In this video, we will show one or more of these icons to alert you when to use caution. As with any repair, be sure you unplug the appliance before beginning. Your first step is to remove the screws at the bottom of the front panel. Now, rotate the panel out from the bottom to release the clips at the top. Noting their location, disconnect the wires from the door switch, as well as from the retaining clip on the panel, and set the panel aside. Release the wires from the front bulkhead. Next, remove the screws to release the front bulkhead from the cabinet. If the old belt is still intact, reach under the drum and push the idler pulley up to release the belt tension. Unthread the old belt from the pulley and motor shaft and pull the belt out. Install the new belt by sliding it over the drum flat side down and loop the belt around the pulley and motor shaft in a zigzag formation. Now rotate the drum to help align the belt. Position the front bulkhead and secure it with the screws. Secure the door switch wires on the retaining clips of both the bulkhead and the front panel. Then reconnect the wires to the door switch. Insert the front panel clips into the slots under the lip of the main top and rotate the panel into place. Secure it with the mounting screws. You're now ready to plug the appliance back in to make sure it's functioning properly.